Hi, I'm Real Gen Entertainment, and this is Dragon Ninja on the ZX Spectrum. Um, I've created a mapping file because it's being played on the Vega, so it'll save you time. It's in the description if you wish to play it or have a look at it. Um, anyway, Dragon Ninja, yes, um, this is a, a conversion of an arcade game which had a much longer title. Um, the arcade game's uh, title was... Uh, um, Bad Dudes vs. Dragon Ninja. Um, I've actually got a recording of the arcade version if you wish to have a little look at it. Um, it's got some flaws. And you can probably see, I mean, when I was playing the arcade version back, I was saying, oh, it didn't hold up very well. But I tell you what, after playing... This is the 128K version of uh, this. Uh, but after playing this version, I have to admit, the arcade version looks superb. Um... Basically, you, you play, um, I don't think it's two-player on the, the Spectrum, I certainly don't think so at all, but um, on the arcade it was a two-player game, you worked your way across these levels, there are actually platforms, and I'll, I'll be blowed if I can work out how to jump down, oh there we go, but I don't know how I did that, so don't don't ask me how that actually happened. Um, you basically play these little bad dudes who are here to rescue um, President Ronnie, who's been kidnapped. Um, I don't know how he's managed to do that, to be fair. Um, and I don't know why these guys, the bad dudes, have been employed to do that. Um, but yeah, so so it doesn't it doesn't hold up in comparison to the arcade version. Is it a good Spectrum game? It's a bit sticky. A um, lot going on though. Um, it's a bit rough on the old sort of. Oh, thing actually things making contact and things actually happening. We've got a knife now. Now I've got a knife. Right. Oh, and here he is. First level bad guy, Karnoff. And here we go. I cannot work out how to jump down. So, so to, to beat Karnoff, you want to be jumping up and down between the levels, and I can't do it. So we got to beat Karnoff here. Let's see if we can do it. Let's just batter him with some punches. See if that will work. No. Poor old Karnoff. Oh, we've done it! Gosh, can't believe I made that. Unbelievable. Yep, so this is the next level. We're on the, the back of a truck, um, which you could jump off in the arcade version as well. And the ninjas climb up and down it. Um, and then there's a guy with massive claws at the far end of here, if we make it all the way. Come on, here we go. As I say, I, I did. I have. I've played the arcade version very recently, and I was. I was sort of a bit dismissive of it. But have, having played the Spectrum version, which I did purchase um, years ago, um, and I thought it was the bee's knees, um, it isn't quite as good as I remember it being. Nostalgia, horrible thing. Makes you think things were brilliant, and they weren't, unfortunately. Um, oh gosh. It's very unforgiving. If you fall off the truck as well, you have to jump back onto it. So, or if you jump off the truck, um, come on, let's see if we can get to the next bad guy. See as far as I can get as far as I got when I played it on the arcade version. That was quite a, that was quite a trek through. Come on, you've got to be dead by now. Get to the front of the truck. Yeah, there's the front of the truck. Can we get to the front and to the bad guy? Yeah, here we go. It says dudes on the truck, and it said that in the original arcade version as well. Here he comes. With spiky, have spiky hands. It seems a little unfair, actually, because he's quite tough. And there's very little to jump on, actually, in this one as well. So you don't even have a particular cover. You just kind of have to avoid him until you, you get him. And it's all over. The bad dudes are dead. President Ronnie is permanently kidnapped, kidnapped for the rest of his life. Um, it didn't go particularly well for him. <laughs> oh, look at that. There we go. Anyway, so yes, so that was uh, Dragon Ninja, as it was called on the Spectrum. Um, Bad Dudes versus Dragon Ninjas on the arcade. I'll put a link to the description to that uh, video too, in case you want to watch it. Um, yeah, nostalgia got me on this one. I actually thought that it was a much, much smoother experience, and sadly it doesn't really hold up as well. They might have done better, I think, probably with smaller sprites, or, or, or gone less conversion-y. But anyway... Um, I've been your host, Real Genetic Demon. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye-bye now.